Orange Beach lifeguards have been busy rescuing people from the water and also people on the beach with heat related emergencies. As WKRG News 5's Debbie Williams reports, the intense heat can mean intense problems no matter where you are. So how do you have a heat emergency on the beach when you've got all that to keep you cool? Well, lifeguards say it can happen. The beaches are packed, the temperature steaming. Finding relief from the heat can be a challenge. Either to get in the water or just like stay in the shade. We've had some pretty extreme heat out here on the beach and uh, you can feel it as soon as you walk outside. It just feels like the air is a little thicker. Even at the beach, there are things you need to know before you go. Drink plenty of fluids and uh, bring uh, canopies or umbrellas. Lifeguards in Orange Beach and Gulf Shores are staying busy with heat related emergencies that are pretty easy to recognize if you know the signs. So if you stop sweating, that's a bad sign. Um, headache, nausea, uh, kind of being forgetful. Getting in the water to cool off would seem obvious, but temperatures there are at 85 degrees. Still, lifeguards say some relief is better than none. It's not the coldest water that we have, but it's definitely a lot colder than the uh, outside temperature. This type of heat is common this time of year, so when coming to the beach, pack all the standard beach gear and a little something extra. It's almost impossible to uh, survive out here for longer than an hour without the shade, so uh, you got to have some form or fashion of shade. On the Baldwin County Beat in Orange Beach, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.